Well, this week we're getting a rare behind the scenes look at just what happens when officers encounter someone on drugs and in the throes of excited delirium. It's a special report that KXY4 Jeff Humphrey has been working on for weeks now. And Jeff, this entire incident that you're about to show us caught on an officer's body cam. Nadine Officer Chris Johnson dutifully rolled on the whole thing and the de-escalation of a young man hopelessly high on LSD and mushrooms was handled so well that body cam video now being used in our police department's critical incident training. Here's an excerpt of our special report. Hey Terrence, Spokane Police. Can you tell me what kind of drugs you took today? Do you know what kind? Officers don't know it, but Terrence is a nationally ranked collegiate wrestler, and now he's tripping on acid and mushrooms. So we got to get medics for you, all right? Nobody wants to hurt you. This is Officer Chris Johnson. He's using the de-escalation techniques he learned during his department's crisis intervention training. I'm in excited delirium here. People suffering from drug-induced excited delirium have racing heartbeats, their body rapidly overheating, their brain baking inside their skull. Hey. Calm down, calm down, take some deep breaths. Fighting with Terrence is only going to make his medical emergency worse, and so officers try to reason with him. Terrence, you don't want to hurt yourself. Oh, nope, I know that. You got to stay here, though. By now, police have already called for paramedics and an ambulance. Can you just, can you just roll on your stomach? Because we don't, we don't want to fight you. You're too powerful for us. Officer Johnson tries to be patient, but Terrence is bleeding, sweating profusely, and the clock ticking down on whether doctors will be able to save him. We need to get you over to the ambulance. Despite the police department's best efforts to yeah. get Terrence to the hospital as quickly as possible, he actually died twice on the way to the twice? emergency. Died twice? We'll show you what happened wow. after that and how Terrence is taking his near-death experience and trying to turn it into a positive, helping the police department warn kids about the dangers mm -hmm. of experimenting with mind-bending drugs. Experimenting and then combining them, too. What a mess. We're looking forward to that. That's tomorrow night on KXY4 News at 6 and 6.30. We'll Have see you then. Thanks a lot, Jeff.